Hello everyone, Grits here. Welcome back to uh, Sniper 4. We're continuing uh, on mission number one. And uh, that's not the proper way to store your uh, weapons. What is our secondary weapon? It's a Thompson. So let's switch to the MP40 and uh, see again if that's going to unlock weapons in our loadout. What is this? Looks like a searchlight. Okay, can we sneak around the edge here? We can. This, uh,. This uh, uh, world seems to be a lot more flexible in uh, what we can and cannot do. I like that a lot. Now the big question is, is uh, if we disrupt this generator, is it going to make noise like it did in the other game? We still got aircraft also. Generators hit return. Hmm. There's got to be a way to disable it, and I think we need that tutorial. Okay, let's uh, let's actually go into the tutorial. See what uh, we can find out. I think it was here. Tab shows objectives. No. Um, how did we do that? Okay. What what did that say? That happened way too fast. He saw us. Okay, but other people know we're here now, so this is not good. Move around here a little bit and then take stock of what we got. Okay, and that'll bring up the tutorial at least. Um... Closer to the enemy fire, yada yada. There's no way to turn the page. Okay, so that's going to be a problem. Um, he is here, and he is angry. And he threw a grenade, it sounds like. And we have a very big white circle, so it's not uh, helping us. Looks like he has uh, stopped his search, but he is still concerned. And I think he sees us. Where is he? Whoa. Is 
So I think that was everybody in the area. We're probably, yeah, we're all clear, so we definitely survived that. Let's get back to the generator and see if uh, we can uh, can't uh, search that body. Okay, uh, let's get back to the generator and see if we can't get back to that tutorial. Oh, uh, the generator is burning. I wonder what happened there. So that's probably not going to help us much. I think I've grabbed all I can. Um, got a lo lot of those weapons. That seems to be their preferred weapon. Oh, you know what it was? Is when he threw that grenade. Trying to get us. He thought we were up there, I guess. He uh, blew up the generator himself. Hopefully we still have the aircraft as cover. Um, but, if nothing else, we can get... Uh... What's that? Yep, aircraft are still here. Okay, we can switch weapons to save... Um... Uh, our ammo and then pick the Springfield up before we leave so that'll be nice okay let's start looking around again seeing if this new perspective offers us any insight of what is going on looks like uh, we can probably take that guy out by dropping that bushel on his head next uh, airplane there's a couple guys down there. Looks like we got a nice uh, little watchtower that we couldn't see from up there. A lot more enemies. This place is just crawling. So probably a good idea we didn't just run headlong into this. Got a bunch tagged this time. Um, we might be able to take that camera out from here and not even have to worry about going over there. 300 meters, that's a little long. Especially with the weapon that I'm unfamiliar with. Okay, we just got confirmation that the uh, air works. So, um, next time we get... Uh, the aircraft will start dropping people. We'll save the officer for last. Okay, so, uh, hit the gas can, but, uh, it didn't explode. All we did is, uh, tick off some, some Germans, so we will, uh, have to wait until next time.
And you know what? Um, these are all 300 meter shots. I'm thinking those might be a little long. So let's see if we can't take out that camera without going up there as a test. And it had turned white, so. Keeps going white, it's dropping. Um, the second shot definitely made our presence aware. But they're far enough away that I don't think I care. Um, I do want to take one more shot at that, but this time I want to use the uh, Springfield. See if uh, we can get a little bit better range out of it. I did not see him down there. I do now. 83 meters. He's, uh, he's definitely doable. Question is, is where is he going? We still have quite a few people aware that we are here. He might be coming up this way. He's got a friend who is definitely getting too close for comfort. Headshot, that'll work. Got a nice little uh, building here that I didn't see before because I was so busy looking long. I don't see a whole lot going on though. Uh, another nice thing is uh, because we have our weapon in hand, we don't have to get out of the binoculars first. If we just hit the right mouse button, which is uh, to scope up, it uh, automatically takes us over there. It's like he's talking to somebody. Does he think his buddy's still there? Or, uh... Nope, someone new. Oh, he was the new guy. Oh, can we get a double shot here? A double kill? No. Watch his friend shit his pants, though. That's nice. Why far are you confused? Have you not seen a head wound before? Okay, he's going to continue up this way. If we take him down now, we may not get the next shot on the camera. Okay, he's turning. Ooh, there's something there. We're going to check that out on our way down. Don't make me rush the shot. Do I want to pick that up or I just want to shoot it? Mm. 
I got him straight in the back of the neck. What the hell is he still standing for? Well, he's not standing now. Uh, we got a medal for 500 XP. And he apparently was the only one in the area. So let's take a look at the map. This was definitely a nice vantage point here. Uh, let's go into this area here, find out what uh, that satchel is, and see if we can get a, a better bead on the area again. So, uh, let's see, we have the Springfield, so we'll hang on to that. I don't see any enemies on our HUD. <clears throat> I hadn't been really paying attention to that though, so I don't know how good that actually is. That sound was uh, like we should have been careful, but uh, again, I don't see anybody. Okay, let's uh, go search us some bodies first. Uh, we'll grab him since we're right here. Nothing else. Wonder if. Uh, Maybe they're in-game uh, achievements, like that eagle on top of the tower we were just at. Uh, no, it was a satchel full of uh, parts. Like it. Uh, it said we picked up some shotgun ammo. Um, don't have a shotgun. Okay, let's go back. Was there a shotgun on the ground we could take? What's that? Oh, that's his, uh, rifle. Uh, nope, that's a pickaxe. Okay, so we're here. Let's take a look at the map. Um, so we still need to get over to here. Looks like we've got a couple in the camp here that we need to worry about. So uh, let's get back to higher ground and see if we can't uh, stop that. See if we can't uh, tag them. Actually, there was another dude down here, wasn't there? Thought we had uh, dropped another one down here. Maybe not. Um, is that a cave? What's a cave do? Let's look at this at the on the map. Um, I don't think this goes anywhere. I think this is just a a place for the troops to uh, to uh, hang out. Okay, so let's go back up to that high ground. Uh, pass through there that I don't think we want to take at this particular moment and see that's the sound from the uh, old game 
that said you your he was in the process of making you. I don't like that sound. Okay, so what do we have here? Go ahead and uh, tag up whatever we can. I know we got a toy box in there we want. There's another guy there we didn't know about. We never did make that shot uh, at the camera. Oh well. This is a new guy. Hundred and thirty-eight meters, three hundred meters, two hundred meters. Can I get him through? the tent no but I did alert them to my presence this can get exciting Okay, are you coming up the road? That's going to be a good hit. <laughs> right in the mouth. Awesome. So, uh, that will complete this episode. Next week, we'll pick up where we left off. So, thank you all for watching, and until then, be safe. <laughs>